Hey, what's up guys, Jimmy here. So being a product slash industrial design student who's going into his senior year, his very last year of formal education, man, I've been in school for a really long time. There's just so much advice I could give to new incoming students, like work hard or have great time management skills, because honestly, having good time management skills is something that got me really far at school. But um, if I can give just one, just one golden rule of advice, it would be to always surround yourself with the best people. Honestly, guys, it's been proven by psychologists and self-improvement leaders that if you just surround yourself with a certain type of group of people, you will slowly start to become like them. It's just the way it works. What do they say the best way is to learn a language? It's to go to a country that speaks that language natively. The reason is because you've surrounded yourself with people that talk that language fluently. And it's just like design. It's you, you surround yourself with the best designers so that you can also be the best yourself. Imagine if you surrounded yourself with people that always turn their work on time. You will always feel pressured to also turn your work on time so that you don't fall behind. But if you surround yourself with people that just blow off deadlines and don't do their homework, you're going to start to think that that's okay. And of course, that's absolutely not okay. So guys, just always surround yourself with the best students, with the best professors. Uh, keep your mentors strong. Keep your relationships strong with them. It's, it's like I said in the last video, and this goes hand in hand with networking. To build that network, to build these relationships, and to always have the best people around you that will always push you. And it's something that I've personally learned these past couple years of just being super incredibly fortunate to have come into a class, talented designers of 40 that I will be graduating with. And they've pushed me every single day to work hard, to, to do my best in every project always making me think that if when I become lazy, I just think, what is this person doing? And this person always has something special pulled out up their sleeve. And it just makes me get out of bed and want to try to do that extra step. And that's just how it works. And special thanks, I just want to have to say shout out to my group of four, which I'm incredibly proud of. Patrick, Matt, and Brian. We were all in a project together for our junior year to compete in a contest called Biomimicry Global Challenge, and we were able to pull it off and win in the living culture section. And it's just incredible that we were able to pull it off with the amount of time that we had because at the time when we were working on this project, we came back from another competition that we were working on and then also having to catch up with all the schoolwork that we had to do. And just being able to pull off this contest, I uploaded a video. If you haven't checked it out yet, it's called Aqua City. So check that out. And uh, it's, it's just, oh, I'm in such a design high right now. It's incredible. And I just want to have to say to another update that I will be flying out tomorrow. I'm all packed up now, out going out of state to compete in another design contest. It's been something that we've been working on for the past couple of years now. And it's finally coming to an end and just incredible some of the stuff that is coming up and i'm just extremely excited and i just wanted to say guys thank you so much for watching this video um if you want me to talk about anything please leave it in this comment section below and i'll try to answer it as best as i can anyway guys hope you enjoyed thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next video bye